は15歳の時。Hey everybody, this is b o o k s h a b i Welcome to the show. Players in for a quick word. From Barnes Canyon Ballpark, Triple A Baseball on MLB The Show. It's the Memphis Redbirds going up against the Nashville Sounds. First pitch coming your way next. Ready to go now. And today's starter, Ethan Small. And Chris, he's hoping for some better fortune moving forward. Well, I'm looking to see if he can increase the amount of swings and misses and perhaps get more strikeouts because hitters are batting over 300 against him, and that means guys are getting the barrel to the ball. Exit velocity's got to be pretty good when you have that kind of batting average, so he's going to have to find a way to do something That's different in this one. Country boy, Mario. There we go, kid. Oh, now this one's high and deep, way back there, on its way, gone. He circles the bases, and they add a pair. It's 2-0. That is his first home run in AAA. A nice little milestone for him on his path to the bigs. 
Yeah, Boog, the more power he shows at this level, the more anxious the organization's going to be to call him up to the show. He won't want to sacrifice consistency for power, but I'll tell you, nothing gets you noticed more than showing good pop at the plate. Country boy Miles now at the plate. He's already homered in this game. The center fielder, country boy Miles. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. He'll touch them all, and they boost their lead. It's seven nothing. Well, he comes through big time with the grand slam here, but you also got to give some credit to the guys ahead of him. Good at bats to get on base and really set the table for a very special moment in this one. Country boy Miles digs in now. He's not going to get cheated up there. No, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. Swing and a base hit. Romero around third. He scores. It's 8 nothing. Fires the second too late. And he's got a double. Drove that ball nicely. Put a great swing on it. And it jumped off his bat. Kind of put it all together there. And he's rewarded with the double. Here's Nolan Gorman. Mendoza on third, Miles at second with one away. Squares and gets it down the left side. To first, and he beats it, everyone's safe. Now batting, the designated hitter, Connor Capel. One out, base is loaded. Connor Capel getting ready to hit. And a one-two. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And there are two outs. Got to give him a huge amount of credit on the mound right there. Got the squeezed right a little bit on the pitch right before that one. You know it should have been a strike. Okay. Everyone in the building knew that it should have been a strike, but he didn't let it get to him and throw him off his game. Came back with another good pitch for the punch out with the bases loaded. That's good pitching right there. Oh, big guy. Get your pitch, huh? And he deals. In the air on the infield. Terang makes the catch, and that'll do it. One down, and now the center fielder, Country Boy Miles, for the fourth time tonight. Country Boy. No matter what, you're playing this kind of rival to take your game to another level. That's ripped, and this one could be extra bases. Now he'll turn for second. Not stopping. He's going for three. The throw to third, and he's out trying for three. The triple is arguably the next to hit. Garrett Mitchell, one for two. A dedicated hitter. And a two-one on the way. This one in the air center field. Miles settles under it. Two down. Plenty of offense in this one, Singy. I guess you'd say kind of what we expected, now though. Batting. Well, base is empty with two away. And now it's going to be Country Boy Miles. Country Boy Miles. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. An absolutely majestic shot, and they add a run. It's 10 to 2. He's putting on quite the show at the dish here in this one, and he's just so locked in with this swing and 
He's just not missing right now. Three homer game, man, it's so special. So two down, here's the center fielder, country boy Miles. With this kind of lead, he can swing freely, try to hit the ball out of the park, do what he loves to do. Oh, this ball is crushed into left field. It's on its way and gone. He flexes his power with that swing, his fourth home run of the season. It's 12-2. Wow, this is awesome. I mean, a four-homer game, they're just so rare, they're so special, and just so tough to pull off as well everything has to line up for you but of course you got to make it happen too and these are the types of performances that people all these guys just hadn't been playing fundamentally sound baseball but today they put it together this should start them rolling now you have to pay attention to the details if you do that with good pitching good defense you will win most of your ball games and your final 12-2 for Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chambi. Talk to you soon. Time of the ball game, three hours and 41 minutes. Thank you for joining us here tonight. He recently got the call to AAA, and he is now within shouting distance of the major leagues. But for now, he'll have to prove that he can compete and excel at this AAA level. Jonathan Mayo of MLB Pipeline is here with me today. How does AAA prepare a player for the majors in a way that AA doesn't? Yeah, I think it's changed a, a lot in, in recent years. They, they used to always say that if you could compete at double-A, you could play in the big leagues. And, and that might be true, but you're seeing fewer and fewer players make that double jump up to, to the big leagues. Organizations want their prospects to play in triple-A. I think it's, a, it's another level of challenge. It's kind of an incremental step rather than throwing them right into the fire of a big league competition. You have a lot of guys at the AAA level who have big league experience. They know how to play at that level. And so he'll face uh, that kind of level of competition, but he'll also be able to pick the brain